as players cracked open bottles at 2M and Jack Grealish displayed his karaoke prowess, Manchester City's Champions League triumph celebrations are in full force and are likely to last far into the evening. After defeating Inter Milan 1-0 at the Ataturk Olympic Stadium to win the club's first Champions League trophy and become only the second English team in history to achieve the triple, City's stars are prepared for a long night of celebration in Istanbul. Even though Pep Guardiola and his team had to overcome a stubborn Inter team, the fact that they won the match in 90 minutes gave the winners plenty of time to celebrate in the Turkish city. The England international Grealish was captured on camera joining part on a cover of Fleetwood Mac's 1987 hit song Everywhere with new lyrics added to symbolize City's triumph in Europe. The 27-year-old winger broke down in tears at the end of the game as he showed his happiness at winning the biggest prize in European football. He wasted no time after the game in downing a drink with his teammates. During his social media a video celebrating City's victory, he was briefly joined by his Norwegian teammate Erling Haaland before the striker left the frame to rejoin the celebration. Grealish, one of several City players who were ready to take a well-deserved drink as realization of their triumph began to set in, is known to like letting his hair down in the off-season. He posed with City kitman Brandon Ashton while they drank from Heineken cans. Holland, meantime, was able to grab hold of the renowned trophy that was being passed around the locker rooms and paused to take a photo that will be cherished by fans all over the world. In a post that had already gone viral, he also included a photo of himself biting down on his gold medal that was not captioned. Players refused to discuss what was planned for after the game, thus nothing was known about the after-party festivities. Guardiola did, however, confirm that a party was being prepared at the team hotel with family and friends. Longtime City employee Riyad Mahrez also took some time to pose with the two-handed Champions League trophy, telling the camera to get in there, come on, as Kyle Walker sneeredly looked over the prize. Mahrez also engaged in some one and on interaction with the renowned trophy as he raised it in the air and grinned directly into the cameras. Walker, who was overjoyed, also provided insiders with a glimpse into the goings-on in the locker room by going live on his Instagram account and providing his 3.5 million fans with a glimpse into the life of a Champions League victor.